Hi, right, this is Travis from down on Dog River. We were noticing just a, a big flow of trash coming behind our house this evening. It is Sunday, about 6.35, and I thought that I would come down and take a look at the litter trap and show everybody what I'm seeing. Now this is the actual trap that's supposed to catch and hold. You can see the two baskets. Yeah, there's a little bit of stuff in there. All right, that's outside of the basket. That spot's empty. That's the flow gate right there that's supposed to open when the river is flowing downstream. But if you look sitting outside, and you can see debris bypassing because of how fast the current's moving. Now I am delighted that this thing has caught this much here, but that's really not in the trap. So what's going to happen as soon as the rainwater stops flowing and you have a little influx of tide, it's going to move up and go between the two piling, work its way down, and all this stuff's still going to be right in my backyard. I'm watching as trash is bypassing. I'm seeing a big wad of trash coming down. And it looks like the stuff that makes it over to the right hand side of the river coming downstream will actually get caught. But again, this stuff's not, not really trapped. It's just laying out there. All it's going to take is just a wind direction change or the current slow down because you're looking inside the trap. There's the door. This is real difficult for me because I'm trying to be positive about this, but I'm here to tell you, this, this is just not working for Travis Rayner on Dog River. And as you're watching the grassy debris that's coming down, it's actually pushing under and coming out on the other side. Now it's very possible that some of the debris that I was seeing behind my house was coming out of the other creek, out of Bolton Branch, but that doesn't negate the fact of what I'm seeing here at the trap. This just isn't working in my opinion. 